Okay, I was going down a big hill and then fell, and uh, the bone that like connects my thumb and my wrist is a little hairline fracture on it. Oh, it's gonna take six yeah. weeks to recover. Six so, weeks? Yeah. So <laughs> like, that really hurts my chances yeah. of getting PR. But like, it's okay because when I come back, I'm gonna be the sickest clown. Okay, okay, okay. It's okay. gonna happen. Did you um, get to play after the cloud bus? Have you played? Since yeah, then? yeah, okay. I did. I did. Okay. I got. I mean, less than a week, but it was okay. still something. I was I was playing friendlies at TGL, and I killed someone with Tipper Up Smash at like 105 on PS2, and I was like, I was just so happy. Why are people doing jumping jacks over there? What? How, oh God, dang it! Oh I yeah, it's spell. How do I spell Emperor? The O and the E are switched. So yeah, got yeah, it. That's how you spell it. Sorry, I can't spell for my life. It's okay, you're a STEM major. You don't have to learn. This is true. This, well, I'm also not a STEM major. So. <laughs> Wait, I do. Where are you? I'm in comp sci and business. So. Comp sci is STEM. Yeah, but I'm also business, and you're supposed to learn how to spell. Uh, theoretically. It's okay, business sucks. Don't major in business. Business, I've heard, is easy. There's always like the memes about people talking about how easy business is. BHP sucks. I hate BHP so much. <laughs> like it is like the most toxic okay. thing ever. All right, fair enough. Sorry, sorry. Um, so I actually, yeah. So Dax is Dax is finally hit the stage along with Emperor. Oh, I, I think I played Dax before. Like I already played his face. No, but I like recognize. Honestly, he looks. He looks like Stegen, but he, I know he's not. He looks like a. He looks like an incinerator. He strikes me as an Incinerator Warman. No, I think he's a Spacey. That's, that's what I would guess. A Spacey or a Pikachu? Yeah, I can see that actually. Because he kind of looks like Inkle. Like who? Inkle? The, I don't know who that the, is. The Fug leader from uh, DFW? Oh, Lucina. No, 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 he plays Falco. No, he plays Lucina. Oh, okay. yeah. <laughs> alright, alright. Yeah, so, Lucina's my third guess, it's okay. Alright, so game one. I'm assuming Lucina. we're going to PS2. Yeah, I see it too. It's a classic. Yeah, All right. it's, the, it's the Smash show in this game. So we've seen against Belmont. Um, that was clean. I've never seen anyone do like near one to jab because I think there's probably more optimal combos, but it just looked cool. I mean, yeah, I mean yeah. it was corner of a stock too because Lucina's jab in this game, or actually Marcina's jab. Yeah. Uh, it actually like traps them in for the second hit, so they kind of took away like the the jab one confirms that you had in Smash Four oh, in favor okay. for like more consistency, and I think you can actually. Um, so the jab lock with it. Yeah, see, he's gonna be using that a lot. Does it kind of pull you in? Like, to jab one? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, okay. They, <laughs> Rob Jab used to do something similar, and then they realized this is a terrible idea. To get out <laughs> for of a character game. that already has a frame four down tilt? Yeah. Yeah, no, because it would, it would combo into down tilt. You could do jab, down tilt, jab, down tilt. Like, oh, that's yeah. disgusting. Yeah, it was really dumb. Oh! Oh my god! Oh, what was that? Okay, 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 I'm sorry. I'm so we're gonna get back to the match, because yeah, yeah, that yeah. was actually sick. Right. I believe he hit a cross into a down air. Like, the cross was on the bottom part of the stage, and Emperor was yeah. on the platform. He hit a down air into the the dagger uppercut. That was and insane. Raw F smash is taking you from Dax, and now it's back to even, but who has the mental advantage here? I know, um, after yeah. that, Dax... Oh. But honestly, oh. Lucina, extremely solid character. Yeah, like, obviously he can come back. Oh, he, he tried to do it again. Yeah, I don't think he wanted the spike hitbox there. I think he wanted the... Uh, the the late hitbox actually hits you up so you can get a, another upbeat. Okay, that makes sense. But yeah, as you can see, like, uh, Belmont's advantage is awful. And if Lucina gets, like, a, a couple, like, in a juggle situation, then Belmont's not gonna have fun. Yeah, and then, but and then the juggle situation is not gonna matter when he's just gonna call out, like, him standing there at max range F smash. Yeah. That, that, that move, even when it's not tippered, it's super powerful. For sure. Oh. oh. Looks like it's gonna be it. Yeah, unfortunately. Yeah, the unfortunate SD. That's... That's that sucks. Yeah, but even if he didn't SC, he would have to get up off the ledge versus the Belmont, which might have been death anyways. So, so I'm actually going to share a little bit of a secret information. I don't know how true it is because I haven't been able to put it into practice. Okay. Because uh, I've been out of commission for the past week. But I saw on Twitter, you could literally jump at a specific time um, where if Belmonts will like throw holy water at the ledge. Uh, you could just wait for the holy water to run out, and if they follow up with an axe, you can just react to them uh, throwing the axe and jump right as like the axe is about to pass you at ledge. And then if they try to S smash you, you could just get up and react with that too. So like if you jump, it's super hard for Belmonts to 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 ledge trap you. Okay, do, but do you not get caught by holy water if you jump, or do you have to time? Um, it? I don't think so. Okay. If you do, oh, I'm sure you can probably bad. nair dodge out of it. So, oh yeah, Emperor's up to one game. game. I keep forgetting the update. Yeah, no worries. Um, 
Yeah, so that's another thing we're going to be seeing a lot from uh, is he Richter. Dead? Oh, he has no, a he has his jump. Okay. Uh, is the up B's in disadvantage. He's kind of he yeah. he follows a similar pattern of like Cloud and Game and Watch, where anytime that anyone's going to touch a shield or he feels any sort of disadvantage, that was a zero to death. Yeah, it was. Um, but anytime he feels any sort of disadvantage on a shield or just in general, he's going to want to up B because uh, it's super fast. I don't know the exact yeah, frame data. But the thing is, it's really punchable. Like Game and Watch and Cloud's up B are way harder to contest when you're coming down. Then, uh, then Belmont's up B. Because Belmont's up B, you just fall. That's true. It puts yeah. him into free fall. Yeah. Um, right now, Emperor is kind of running over him. On his counter pick, too. Yeah. Oh, is he? Up B? Okay, yeah. Okay. Up B does not kill until super late, especially right. in town. Oh, um, I think I he could have gotten a harder punish off the of holy water. Oh, oh, he calls out the air dodge with the axe, so I think it was just a little bit late on the conversion. Yeah. That is another uh, mix up that you can get out of Very uh, down air. Really? I've never seen anyone do that. Oh, he tries to go deep at the edge guard, which is what you should do against Belmont. But he just isn't able to get it this time. Right. But that Emperor's like maneuverability around the ledge with his uh, with his recovery, mm -hmm. he, he makes it really hard um, to gimp to gimp himself on, especially a really sure. easily gimpable character. I love those jumps. Those jumps before you throw out the projectile, just so there's like more time in between when the projectile lands and when it. Uh, right. When you, you throw it out and when it lands, you're covering a lot more yeah. space and being a lot more threatening. <laughs> And it's just, it probably looks confusing too. Okay, so this is looking really rough for Dax yeah, right now. Yeah, Dax kind of struggling to find some sort of foothold here. Yeah. Uh, he's he's not exactly knowing what to do oh, with, with all these uh, oh, no, he's still with all these projectiles. Ooh. I've never seen the Belmont edge guard. <laughs> like, I've he, always seen Belmont run to the like kind of center, throw out projectiles. That was sick. Right, because yeah. if, if you yeah. go off an edge guard, you're like risking your life. You're going to die. Yeah, for sure. At like 40. If you got hit by a bear, you were dead. he was dead. Yeah. Or unless you teched it, but like you know, like it's it, there's there's not enough of a yeah. reward, too high of a risk for too little of a reward. Uh, sure. So that's why a lot of elements are gonna want to stick with that much shot. But I think 